The Independence Day celebrations are behind us. It was fun, wasn't it? It was so beautiful. And all those fireworks uh, lead us to the 5th of July, which often brings big challenges to animal shelters. Yeah, our name of Pescovist tonight shows us why it's even more complicated here in central Indiana and what you should do if you find a stray. The problem is really twofold. On the 4th of July, a lot of pets run off from the sound of fireworks and end up at the shelter. But also, a lot of shelters are closed today, leaving the ones that are open packed. It's louder than usual at the Southside Animal Shelter. I mean, it's just been all day since before we opened. People have been calling. People have been coming in with strays. I've had to turn probably 10, 10 away at least um, already today. With strays streaming in, this shelter is full. What I've been telling everyone is just to, um, if they can, keep them in a bathroom or a garage or somewhere until tomorrow when some of the other shelters are open. If your pet didn't run off, but you're still noticing he seems shy or scared, veterinarian Dr. Neil Villanueva says it's okay to give a little love. Some people say that, well, you don't want to enforce that fear behavior by, you know, giving them attention, but really the fear is already there. And, you know, giving them nice, calming, long strokes on their body, talking to them in a calm manner, that seems to help a lot, too. Um, this little guy was a stray, and uh, so we were hoping to find his family. He's about a year old. Still searching for a missing dog or cat, or did you find one near your home? I love Call nearby shelters and post a picture to Indie Lost Pet Alert. It can often be the key to a sweet summer reunion. Please make sure the pet's uh, safe. I know that sometimes it's an inconvenience to have a, another pet in your home, but it's so important to make sure that they're, you know, not going to get hit. It's just one more reminder to get your dogs and cats microchipped, even if you're a new pet owner. John and Andrea. Oh, look at that little bitty one. So cute. <laughs> so cute. And we have another reminder tonight about the dangers of leaving pets and vehicles this time of year. Yeah, in fact, a brand new law went into effect here in Indiana on July 1st, protecting those who break in to save the animals. Now, take a look at this tonight. Police in Boynton Beach, Florida, posted this video to its Facebook page. Well, someone called them after noticing a pit bull left in a hot car that was parked in a bank parking lot. An officer used a baton to break a window and rescue the dog. Officers gave the dog some water and shade. The owner returned about 15 minutes later, saying the drive through line was too long, so she went inside the bank. Officers spent a little time educating her about the state's animal cruelty law, and they ultimately did let her take the dog home. Yeah, from dogs to even yourself.